Size matters, and in Samsung's eyes, bigger is better. Why prod daintily at a tiny little screen when you can stretch your palm out across something that blurs the line almost completely between phones and tablets? Let's say hello then to the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. The Note 3 is every bit as enormous as its predecessor. It's got a larger 5.7 inch display, but with slimmer bezels, the body size hasn't increased. That means more screen with less bulge in your pocket. Still, if you're used to the 4 inch iPhone 5, this will be quite a stretch to get used to. The screen has a full HD resolution, making even tiny text and web pages look crisp and clear. It's one of Samsung's Super AMOLED Displays 2, which has incredibly vivid colour and high contrast. It's certainly a screen to keep you movie fanatics happy. There's a host of software on board too to help you make the most of the S Pen. Samsung has updated its S Note app to let you create little booklets of notes. You can email people by drawing commands on the screen, draw a little YouTube window into existence, or draw around something on screen to take a screenshot of it. It's running on the latest Android 4.3 Jelly Bean software, which Samsung has loaded up with the usual massive extras. Its translator tool, health app, and usual multiple app stores are on board, as is the handy dual screen apps tool. The vast quantity of preloaded stuff does make it rather confusing though, particularly if you're new to Android. It's powered by a quad-core processor or an eight-core one in some areas that's clocked at a mighty 2.3 gigahertz. It gave some astonishing results in our benchmark tests, so rest assured that whatever you throw at it, it'll be able to handle without hesitation. Around the back is a 13 megapixel camera. It comes with much of the same functions found on the S4, including HDR and panorama modes, as well as the daft dual shot mode. Its video camera is able to capture footage in an impressive 4K resolution at 30 frames a second. That is some serious resolution, but you will need a 4K display to play it back properly. Turn the resolution down and you can shoot 120 frames a second for some funky slow motion action. Physically, it's easy to see the family resemblance to the rest of the Galaxy line with the chrome effect speaker and shiny edging. The back has a new leather effect coating too, but don't worry vegans, it's not real leather. It feels quite nice and I think looks pretty smart too. With its enormous size and price to match, the Galaxy Note 3 really isn't going to be to everyone's tastes. Those of you who prefer the nostalgia of handwriting notes will appreciate the stylus, while the immense power will come in handy to the super users and the gamers among you. If you're looking for a beast of a phone to finally replace your knackered old laptop, this could be the device for you. I'm Andrew Hoyle for CNET, and this is a Samsung Galaxy Note 3.